A non-governmental organization is providing education and training to Nigerian youths who want to pursue interest in technology development. Hackathon Africa 2.0 has now trained scores of youths from the five southeast states who engaged in a three-month skill training. Bamidele Ajayi has more, and then we'll return with a business update. Stay with us. Studies have revealed that in 2017, the digital economy alone constituted 6.9% of United States of America GDP of $1.4 trillion. Despite establishing a link between digital infrastructure and productivity, there is a deficit knowledge about the relationship with African countries regarding the impact of technology on economic growth. The challenge before most entrepreneurs is on how to explore opportunities that technology provides. I'm really proud of each and every one of them because they have been able to go through the rigors of this um, training. Um, we had a new curriculum for this particular cohort. Um, AI is the in thing now and we have applied that in the um, learning curriculum for this year's cohort. The gap is just that we need to have more people in between the government, the civil society, the NGOs between the government and the people, and you're going to have a lot of tech hubs. In an attempt to fill in the gap, these young Nigerians are exposed to various tech trainings. I'm going to the health space because obviously you know many people in Nigeria live with ulcer, so it's one of the um, problems that we saw we could provide a solution for. So this is my first time of participating in this kind of program and it really, really uh, helped me achieve the project. Amarachi Nyaka works on a project of connecting artisans to their customers by the use of online platforms, claiming the knowledge acquired will enhance our proficiency. It's really taught to my flesh a whole lot, like we had a whole ups and downs, especially in the collaboration. So I really learned how to collaborate with different people because I've been a lone trainer and this is the first time I'm doing this type of very serious team collaboration. The youth were exposed to tech programs on Fast API, Python, JavaScript, Tailwind CSS, and a class on the use of artificial intelligence. Bamidili Ajayi, TVC News, Enugun.